welcome to Techie Talking. Hello friends. In this video, I'm going to explain about the bitwise NOT operator. It is represented by using the till symbol. Bitwise NOT operator reverses both the binary value and the sign bit. That is, NOT of positive number will result in a negative number and NOT of negative number will result in a positive number. So this means that we are going to deal with the signed binary values. Since bitwise NOT reverses the bits, it only needs one operand or a variable or a value to perform the operation. As we all know, computer or any digital system can understand only 0 or 1. So in case of negative numbers, it is not possible to store a negative sign before any binary value. So for representing that minus sign before a binary number, we use a sign bit. The sign bit will be 0 in case of positive and 1 in case of a negative number. These kind of signed representation of a binary value can be expressed in two complement form. For example, consider a variable a which holds the value 4. To get the bitwise not value of this 4, I will give a tilde symbol before the variable. So let's try to print it and see what result we get. We get minus 5. Now let's understand how this works. First, this integer value 4 will be converted to a binary value. As we all know, for converting an integer to a binary value, we'll have to divide it by 2 until we get a remainder to be 1 or 0. So the binary value of 4 is 100. 0, 0. And this is the truth table of the NOT operation. 0 will be converted to 1 and 1 will be converted to 0. So what is the binary value of 4? 1, 0, 0. And since we will be dealing with the negative values in case of the NOT operation, we need a sign bit. So 0 is the sign bit. So 0 means it is a positive value. When I do a NOT operation on this 4, it is just going to reverse the bits. Meaning, 0 will be converted to 1. 0 here will be converted to 1. 1 will be converted to 0. And the sign bit 0 will be converted to 1. Meaning, the positive sign will be converted to a negative sign. The moment we encounter a negative value, if the sign bit changes to 1, we need to represent it in 2's complement form. So for representing this binary value in 2's complement form, what we need to do is just keep the sign bit aside. Let it be 1. The not on this 4 is 0, 1, 1. The 1's complement on this binary value will be 1, 0, 0. What does the 1's complement do? It is just going to reverse the bits, which means 0 to 1 and 1 to 0. So this 1 will be reversed to 0, this 1 will be reversed to 0, and this 0 will be reversed to 1. And on this 1 complement value, we need to do the 2's complement. What is a 2's complement? We will have to add 1 to the 1's complement. So this is the 2's complement value that we get. 1, 0, 1 with a sign bit of 1, meaning it is a negative value. Next, what we have to do is convert it back to the integer value. 1, 0, 1. So 1 will be multiplied with 2 power 0. So 2 power 0 is 1 into 1. So that will be 1. And 0 will be multiplied by 2 power 1. So 2 power 1 is 2 into 0 so the value will become 0 and then this 1 will be multiplied by 2 power 2. 2 power 2 is 4 and 4 into 1 is 4. Next we need to sum all these values. So the integer value of 1 0 1 is going to be 1 plus 0 plus 4 which is 5. But, but we have a sign bit here 1 which indicates that it is a negative value. So this integer value 5 will be minus 5. 
and this is the result that we got in Python as well. Next, let's consider a negative value, say minus 4. And we want to do a bitwise not on this negative number. So we'll have to first convert it to a binary value. So the binary value of 4 is 100. Since it is minus 4, we are going to have a sign bit 1 followed by the binary value. The moment we encounter a sign bit to be 1, it has to be first converted to 2's complement. So we are going to first do a 1's complement on this value, which is minus 4 is 1, which is the sign bit, followed by 1, 0, 0. And the 1's complement is all about flipping the binary values. So 0 becomes 1, this 0 becomes 1, and this 1 becomes 0. Just keep aside the sign bit. We should not be touching it now. Next, we'll have to do the 2's complement on this 0, 1, 1. So what is 2's complement? We'll have to add 1 to 1's complement. In the binary addition, 1 plus 1 is 10. So we have 0 here and 1 is the carry forward. So that 1 plus 1 is again 10. So we have 0 here and 1 gets carry forwarded and 1 plus 0 will now become 1. So the 2's complement of this negative number will be 1, 0, 0 with the sign bit of 1. On this binary number, we are going to do the NOT operation. So what does the NOT do? It is going to reverse the bits in the binary number along with the sign bit. So 1 which is the sign bit, followed by 1, 0, 0, will now become 0, which is the sign bit, which means the negative value will now become a positive value. And then 1 gets reversed to 0, 0 gets reversed to 1, and 0 gets reversed to 1. So this is the final binary value that we have obtained after doing the NOT operation. Now this value should be converted to a integer value. So for that, we are going to multiply it with 2 power 0, 2 power 1 and so on. So we have 0, 1, 1 here and this 1 is going to be multiplied with 2 power 0. So 2 power 0 is 1 into this 1 which will be 1 into 1 which is 1. Next we have this 1 which we will multiply with 2 power 1. So 2 power 1 is 2 into 1 which is 2. And this 0 will be multiplied with 2 power 2. 2 power 2 is 4 and 4 into 0 is 0. So to get the integer value of this binary number which is 0, 1, 1, we need to add these numbers. So 1 plus 2 plus 0 which is equal to 3. So the bitwise not on minus 4 is 3. Let's try to execute this in Python and see what result we get there. We get 3 here. Hey guys, hope you now understood how the bitwise not operation works on positive and negative numbers. Thank you for watching this video. If you have any queries, you can reach out to me at techytalkie at gmail.com. Happy learning and have a great day.